Alrighty, everybody. Thank you for uh, tuning in on today's match. We're going to join in on the second half of eHostage versus Web Gaming. They're going to go ahead and nade spec, or they're going to nade till 2 2, and we'll go ahead and go from there. So, um, right now, we unfortunately, um, our lovely producer here, Eric, gave out the password to their match, so we had to restart. So, we're going to go ahead and go back into their match and again start from 2 2 on the second half of Ankara. Well, here we go. Second half. To, I know. I believe they're gonna nade until two two. So we'll give them a little bit till then. Any predictions? Um, I see hostage doing somewhere. Hopefully, um, they will be able to defeat the highly reputable web gaming. Uh, quick shout out here to Emily. It was Lux's lovely wifey. She's a very nice lady, and I would be proud to have such a stunning young young man as my boyfriend. But um, it looks like we will be going now. Both teams have naded each other. And it will be starting off here. Waiting for the BL team to drop those nades. This is the second half if I'm correct. I don't know how the first half went. Here we go. Now it's 2-2. Two -two. They're going to go ahead and uh, start off here. We're not too sure on the first half score, but we're just going to go from here whenever the end is, however it's going to go. We apologize that we can't bring you every match due to the fact that it would take a multiple amount of casters and uh, streamers. But uh, we're doing our best here, and uh, like again, I'd say thanks, Eric, but it's going back into the game. Gons is going to open up with a frag over here at a site. This is gonna, uh, what beer is gonna take out France in that process to make it 4v3 situation. And it does look like they have a pretty strong hold on the A side, knowing that the bomb is right up there. Gon's grabbing the bomb, and he will be rotating. A very smart move by him. Him, Logic, and it was luck. Uh, the three remaining players left on the BL team, as it is a 3v4 situation. Both players rotating off the A side, possibly just one. And Trio Ray will be going back to that B site to group up with the rest of the, his team. Looks like they're going to group up and now make their way towards A site with only one guy on A also. And that's going to be Flat, or I'm sorry, Web Bear himself. He's going to be here waiting, and as they all see, they'll be able to meet him there. Gons with. 65 HP, it was, it was luck with 100 and logic with only 13, 4v3. So, I mean, you know, they're not out of this yet, but it's going to be very difficult. Now, this was a, a very good false rotate here, but it, it seems that they didn't go quick enough as there's two players back on this A site watching the top. Gon's taking out Flash with a nice little one click, I believe that's what I heard. Gon's here playing ever so gingerly here. Right through these A, A connectors. And he will be pulling back. It was Luck following him close behind. And they will be taking this to the B site. Not knowing that there is someone watching A. Gone spotting Trio Ray. Not doing only, any damage though. With only 30 seconds left on the clock. They're going to have to fall back into B connector. And they're not spotted. Dong is going to come for a flash. And now they're going to realize. They're going to give a nade over. Nice nade by Trio Ray. Gonna lit them up just a little bit, and bomb's gonna get ahead and bit planted by it was luck. 3v3 situation here, and the bomb is down at B site as now they're kind of pinched into this little corner. And boy, Bear's gonna take one out. Oh, makes it 3v1. Oh, and that's gonna make it 3v0. And now we're gonna go ahead and see Web Gaming pick up that round, making it 3 to 2 in their favor. Not quite impressed with Don's positioning on that round. Put his back all the way to those offices. Probably not the best idea, but his heart was in the right place as he was trying to watch that rotate coming through. He just had the wrong idea of where they were coming from. Trio sweep with the op right through Don, sweeping him right off of his feet. Drenkip here, taking a few shots through the smoke, not quite sure what he's aiming at, possibly hoping to get a frag, watching these ventilation areas. 
he has to just kind of making his way towards B so it looks like they're trying to work a pick at this point and then go for a direct site push as they're down one player in a 5v4 situation right now Swerve is actually dropping bomb and connector is going to make an interaction here with Dong but Dong is just going to go ahead and fall back on him not looking to do too much there um France is going to give a nade over. As you can see, we're still definitely looking for a pick as that's what they feel they need to go ahead and enter a site as one guy is there. Ooh, nice shot by I like Dream to take out Sweep. Very nice shot there. And now it's going to make it a 4v4. That's the pick that they need. And it looks like they're going to go ahead and work towards B site as they have the bomb going to head towards it, connect or mid. And we also have I like Dren <laughs> here. Um... And Connector just sitting at A, looking to get a pick over in the spawn. Still 4v4 situation, nothing has happened yet, but he did have that nade over, and that's definitely going to give his spot away. Trio Ray does see him, going to light him up with 33 HP. Now they're going to push out on him on mid here. Dog's going to take him out, makes it 3v3. Jenner there was pretty much in a... Not, not the best situation he could have been in. He probably should have hopped off of that central guy and went under but he just did not have the time, thought he would have been able to hit that shot. But luckily enough, when uh, he passed over in front of those B arches, or those A arches, excuse me, he could have been taken out pretty easily by Ray. Ray went and moved, and he came back and got the shot. And they will get the defusal. I do have to say that it was great execution by Web... Web gaming and how they came in together as a team. They didn't stop. They kept pushing. Nobody lagged behind. They did a great job of just pushing together, and that's what definitely got to them round to make it now 4-2 in the second half. Yeah, E hostage. Understanding that they might have to take this A site, seeing as or this B site, seeing as A site is pretty stacked here. They're also going to make an aggressive push from Web Gaming, and they're going to go ahead and try to push out Long Hay here, and they're going to get, send a guy connector. Now it's kind of behind them, going to head towards spawn. Yeah, Web Gaming definitely under, understanding that they are heading towards B. They don't see him anywhere in A or mid, so they can only be in one other place. This could be some action right here, seeing this, although they might double back. Trio Ray is going to get lit up here with 15 HP, can spam through that box, but still nothing, no deaths just yet, as we have a guy here in mid, Trio Sweep was there with his up, and he's going to go ahead and try to encounter somebody, he has 54 HP. Oh, nice nade to take him out, Dren also picking up a frag to make it 5v3, definitely great advantage here now, they're going to try to make their way, it looks like towards A side as Bomb is kind of lured towards that way, correction, they're going to fall off, give a flash over to A, and make their way towards B, let's see, but Flash is going to make it 4v3 now. And right here is trying to get this frag in with so little HP, he understands that there's only 50 seconds on the clock, they have to do something, and they will be playing picks here it looks like in the last the last remaining seconds of this definitely a lot of rotating by e hostage a lot more than i think is necessary um but it's going to make a 2v2 situation at the beginning they had a 4v or i'm sorry 5v3 i believe and now they're down uh, 2 to 2 so great comeback here by web gaming this now they're going to enter the site and they also have Flash on the flank, and Adon going to be here on site. Logic is going to spot him. Flash is behind, and that's going to be um, a little problem there for Logic because he's not paying attention too much. Oh, now he's going to make his way towards that way. Adon is on site. Push up. Logic's going to take him out. 46 HP. 1v1 situation. Not looking too good here for Logic as he Flash knows where he is. He's going to try to get for that defuse. Logic is looking for the fake, and Flash is going to take him out. And that's going to give it another round for Web Gaming 5-2. I definitely believe that Logic should have should have known that he was going to fake the defuse. He shouldn't have popped out right away. He should have played it, listened for the second click on that bomb, and then peeked out. But everyone makes mistakes. He did have the quick defuse, so he probably could have stayed on it and got that defuse. I definitely agree. The you know the angles you have to play that angle, and it, that all just comes down to how you feel comfortable. I'm sure that the adrenaline's going, and he's feeling like oh god, oh god, the bomb's being defused. I gotta go after it. And you know sometimes you just don't think about it. So you know nice try there. But now we're gonna go ahead and start this next round here, five versus four, as Dren is gonna take taken out over in the middle by trio sweep and it was us to open a frag over at b-side now b-side is taking over swift friends is gonna get naded before he can even plant the bomb makes it five oh four v one wow e or a web gaming just coming out of nowhere it was like it's gonna go for one guy making one v three 
A dog's gonna give him an easy shot as he crouches and tries to deagle. It was luck in midair. It was luck. Oh, <laughs> nice try by the. Wow. It was like I'm kind of putting a bad situation there, and E Hostage is not doing so hot right now. Is Web Gaming is gonna pick up another round since we've started streaming six to two. Yeah, Gonzo's definitely in a position to frag up in those up in those uh, offices. He did see A Dog, but he just wasn't able to take him out. But Gonz taking Flash this time after Flash takes it was luck down. They will be calling it. It's going to be a B push again. One player in these unders. Possibly fragging on Drenkip. Gons and Drenkip staying together. Looking for this frag on Adong. Wouldn't be wise to peek them again. Gons is gonna try to get this bomb down. Taking heavy damage. Smart enough to stay behind these little generators and put this bomb down. Nade it down to 7 HP. This could be a very interesting round. Logic taking out Adon. All they have to do is play this bomb. They have planted it. And it's been down for a while. The time is ticking down. Gons with an amazing frag with only 7 HP. Got the FP. It's not looking good for this round. No, it's not. Logic could not take out Web Bear. And it looks like that's going to end the game as Web Gaming's going to leave it with 7 2. And we are unaware of the first half score. And I'm sure it must have been somewhat close to this because this match would have not gone on too much longer than it should have. We're just looking to get the results of this match, trying to get the final score here by some of the players. They're not saying anything. Not too much manner here by either sides. <laughs> well, I'm sure that they're uh, being told, let's get the hell off of the computers because we got another match, but we'll see if we can get it off of somebody. Um, but definitely a good game and a good half there. Web gaming kind of dominating that half from the streaming. Um, so, well, we're going to go ahead and uh, take a break here. Thank you guys for tuning in on this match. We'll have another one coming in just a bit for the Frost Gaming Land of 2013.